Now, I hope you guys are doing well today. Today's Friday, and something pretty exciting has happened. You can find it and read and listen to the whole video over on interbulation.org by Boris, who I believe is an ex-CIA agent. He's very cool. He's given, a, in, in the video, he, and he called me to tell me about this, and he said they have now opened up an FBI account regarding the Church of Scientology abuses. Okay, so if anything has happened to you that is not right, that is criminal, or is just, you know, any of their fair game activities, if they've been following you, if they've sent private investigators after you just because you were picketing, I'm not sure which of these things crosses the line or not, but they're going to start looking into it. And uh, all of us who have donated hundreds and thousands of dollars to this organization and per their own policies, David Miscavige, you're supposed to be giving that money back to us, per Hubbard. He said, if they don't want it, give them their money back, let them go. And you know what? You haven't given me my money back, and I can think of about a couple thousand, probably a hundred thousand people, they haven't given their money back either. Families who have been broken up, and uh, your children, where they've disconnected from you, I would suggest reporting it to them. I can't say that that's anything that they can do anything about. It may be covered by their religion, but we don't know where the line draws. And you know what I mean? These people that are locked up, you know, the people who know about the senior executives locked up at Hemet, that's mind control, okay? You and I know that. So those guys should be investigated. They've been there since 2000. That's an awful long time to be locked in an SP hall. The scavenge, your day has come, baby doll. And uh, this stuff is going down. So I want everybody, listen to Boris's video. If, you know, if anything has been done to you that you think is not right, families, money, fair game, you know, private investigators, people following you, stalking you. These are all things Scientology does that most people don't know about because it's the dark side of things. You see, I was born in a country that in 1945 became a communist country. If we were fearful, Poland would still be a communist place. So would Russia, so would Czech Republic, Slovakia, many other countries, these people had guts to stand up and fight. Now, the, in the United States we have a different situation. We are not occupied by foreign power. It is our country with our government, as inefficient as it is, but we still have the agencies that are assigned to take care of you. Go to them, go to the FBI, go to the police, make a report, ask the agent in charge or the police officer, ask for a business card, write on the back of his business card the date and time when you filed your complaint. What kind of complaint can you file? Well, if you have been harassed, if you have been fair gained, if you have been threatened, and you don't come and say, I am scared. You say, I have been threatened, I have been harassed. Because you are not scared, you are not supposed to be scared. You are supposed to fight back. And we hire those servants of this country, FBI, police, yes, they are our servants. They serve us. We pay their self. It is not they do us a favor. They do their duty. And if they don't do their duty correctly, then we know what to do. You can win enormous federal lawsuit against them. If they tip the Church of Nonsensology, we will know it. So, my advice to you is do it. Do it as soon as it happens. Do it if it happened before. Or take dates. You don't have to prove a damn thing. You have to make a report. 
you're not here to prove anything uh, you don't have you're not an investigator you are giving a tip you are a whistleblower whistleblower is a very noble function it is not like you are a snitch snitch is something else snitch is somebody like a bribed police officer who would snitch to Scientology and he can be taken care of through legal means don't do anything illegal go the most legal way go again go to district attorney's office if you don't trust the police station go to the district attorney office and file your complaint go to the FBI there are six parts of interview with ex-FBI counterintelligent agent Courtney West. See all six parts of it. I know it will take you an hour. Good heavens. So what? Watch all of them. There, are, There's a treasure of good advices in those videos. See them all. You have questions. You have additional questions. Give me a note. I will try to respond to all of them.